Some dogs eat anything and everything within paw's reach without a care in the world. And while it makes for great social media content, your dog's curious nature can be dangerous if they eat toxic ingredients or dangerous objects. If your dog consumes a toxin or dangerous object, you naturally want to get it out of their system as soon as possible, and making your dog throw up may be an option. However, you should never induce vomiting in your dog without consulting a vet. In some cases, vomiting can be dangerous for your dog and cause more problems. I'm Dr. Julie, your go-to native pet vet, and this is Valentino. Today, we're talking about how and when you can safely make your dog throw up. There are several situations when inducing vomiting is dangerous and can be life-threatening for your dog. Don't induce vomiting if your dog has ingested a corrosive object or toxin, has ingested a sharp object, has ingested a petroleum or oil-based product, or is a flat-faced breed, including pugs, bulldogs, shih tzus, French bulldogs, and Pekingese. These breeds also have an increased risk for aspiration pneumonia when vomiting. Other situations include your dog has undergone a recent abdominal surgery, is already showing signs of toxicity, and has ingested a dangerous item more than two hours ago. On the other hand, there are some common pet toxins that can be removed by making your dog throw up. These include chocolate, sugar-free foods that contain xylitol, onions, garlic, or chives, grapes or raisins, human anti-inflammatory medications, antifreeze, toxic plants like marijuana. You likely have a first aid kit on hand, but adding a dog-specific kit can ensure you're always prepared in case of a pet accident. Various pre-made first aid kits are available, or you can assemble your own kit using this checklist. You should add the following to your dog's throw-up kit. Fresh, non-expired, 3% hydrogen peroxide. Concentrations that are higher can be dangerous to dogs and expired peroxide may not work. A syringe without a needle or a turkey baster. A measuring spoon, gloves, plastic bag, and cleaning supplies. And the contact numbers for your veterinarian. In the event your dog ingests something dangerous, call your veterinarian immediately. If it's after hours, call the closest veterinary emergency hospital or the ASPCA Animal Poison Control Center. If your veterinarian recommends that you induce vomiting, follow these steps. Since Valentino is perfectly healthy, we will be using water instead of hydrogen peroxide to demonstrate how to make your dog throw up. First, feed your dog a small meal if they have not eaten in the last two hours. A fuller stomach will increase the chances of a successful vomiting event. Next, fill a turkey baster or syringe with a half to one teaspoon per 10 pounds of your dog's body weight. Never give a dog more than three tablespoons of hydrogen peroxide. Then gently pull back your dog's lips on the side of their mouth and slowly squirt in the peroxide. It can also be administered at the front of your dog's mouth, but make sure to go slowly to prevent them from inhaling the peroxide into their lungs. Also, foaming at the mouth is completely normal. Then wait 15 to 20 minutes and closely monitor your dog for vomiting. If they appear to be smiling, it's a good indication that they are nauseous and will soon throw up. Don't let them re-ingest their vomiting. Make sure to collect the vomit for your vet to confirm the toxic substance or object has been removed. If no vomiting has occurred after 15 minutes, a second dose can be given, but never exceed three tablespoons total volume of the hydrogen peroxide solution. At this point, if your dog has not vomited, bring them to your veterinarian. In some cases, they will need to administer a prescription medication like apomorphine to safely make your dog throw up. Additional medical care may also be required. Now that you know how to safely make your dog throw up, you should also be aware of how not to. Never use salt, alcohol, Epicac, or olive oil to induce vomiting in your dog. And never try to make your dog throw up by sticking your finger down their throat. Dog proofing your home and keeping all chemicals, human foods, and medications out of paw's reach is the best way to prevent ingestion of a dangerous food or object. To help decrease the chances of your dog acting out by ingesting dangerous objects or foods out of boredom, provide them with exercise, 
proper nutrition and enrichment tools and chews, like Native Pets Yak Chews, which provide hours of mess-free chewing. You should also consider giving your dog Native Pets Probiotic Supplement to support their gut flora and GI tract during the recovery from diarrhea or vomiting. And always consult your veterinarian when your dog's health is compromised for any reason. For more tips on keeping your pet happy and healthy, be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out the Native Pet blog.